It's time for baseball now as the show's tour of the minors continues with a stop in the Southern League. A good matchup here for you tonight between the Mississippi Braves and the Pensacola Blue Wahoos. And we'll also give you a quick look at our two starting pitchers as you see their numbers right there. John English will get his first shot here. A couple of hits in four trips last night. And he chased one there as this is bounced to short. Throw just does beat him to the bag as that was pretty close. David Robinson will stand in. Trying to keep up the hot pace as he's well over 400 here to start the year. Uh, and he couldn't hold back that time. They say he went around at strike one. Now a fastball swung on and hit pretty well out to deep left field. And he's kicked off the second with a home run. A solo shot here to left. Sixth home run on the season for him. And this ball game is tied at one. Well, I think it's pretty fair nowadays to call this guy a young phenom out there. He, he's starting to get some national press. He's one of the better prospects around, and he gives you a look right there of why folks are so bullish on his future. Scott Ferreira will stand in in what would appear to be a sacrifice situation here. 2-2 pitch on the way. Ground ball to second. This could be two. The second for one. On to first. So they let him swing with two strikes, and it'll cost him as it's a double play. David Robinson will stand in again. He homered his first time around. Good biting slider there, hit on the ground down to third. Throw on to first, so a good comeback there as he gets the first out of the inning. Alex Aviles will dig in. He singled his first time around. Swinging a ball, hit on the ground. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. So nothing happened. David Robinson will stand in. He homered back in the second inning of this one. And he might have another one as this is hit high and deep out to left. And that is over the wall. Home run. A solo shot here to left. His second of the game as they stretch the lead to 5-1. Ethan Hewitt will step in now. He's bounced out and flown out in his first two plate appearances. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground is short. And a leap over at first, but he comes down with his foot on the bag to record the out. Whew. Sometimes this is all you have to do. Throw a ton of strikes and keep the ball in the yard. It's worked for him so far. Alexis Portillo will dig in. He singled his last time around. On the ground is short. Throw in time, and the side is retired. So no runs here. Gus Bryant will stand in. He flew out his last time up. On the ground to second base. This could be two. One there. On to first. It's a double play as their woes continue. The Jesus Molina 
is on to pitch now as he'll take over to start inning number seven. David Robinson will stand in again as he looks for home run number three in the ball game as we flash you back here to his second home run. This was back in the fifth inning as he has the long ball working in his first few at bats. Oh, he checked his swing there and pops this one up. Soto is there to put this one away, and it takes just one pitch to record the first out of the seventh. David Robinson stand in with two home runs already under his belt in this one. Robinson. And we kick off the ninth inning with a swinging strike here. Nothing in one. Oh, and this at-bat is quickly moving from bad to worse. It's 0-2 now. Good biting slider there. Hit on the ground down to third. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. And that's probably going to be his final at-bat, so you figure he won't get his third home run of the game, but still, he's been a real handful here in this one. Neftali Soto will dig in now, and he'll do so representing the tying run. Yeah, and you're not too worried about this guy jumping the yard on you here and tying the ball game. On to first, and he rolls a double play ball to end it here as this ball game is over. Yep, and one last double play here to end it. And that puts the capper on a good win for these guys, and they really played well. And a good offensive performance here, but I think we can agree on naming this fellow right here as our top player of the game. Yeah, he connected on a couple of long home runs. Really put his guys on his back and carried them to the victory. So that'll just about do it. For Eric Caro, Steve Lyons, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out the theshownation.com.